This is Roblox Master Chef. This is a show where regular Roblox players become true masters of the kitchen. Expect mistakes. A lot of stress. My pizza dough isn't rising. <laughs> and occasional tears. What even is this? This is disgusting. <laughs> this is Roblox Master Chef. The first ever episode of Roblox Master Chef will feature three of the world's most renowned food critics from all over Roblox. Known for his ferocious temp and fiery attitude, he is here to flip tables and smash salmon. It's Gordon Ramsay. I expect nothing but perfection. Full of wit and attitude, this Polish chef knows when someone cuts corners of their dish. She's harsh but fair. It's Magda Gessler. What ja tu w robię? Chcę do domu. And last, world-renowned cannibal, I, I mean chef, with tons of experience cooking within Roblox, he is your host and showrunner, it's Mr. Smarty Pants. Now this is going to be interesting. Together, they will judge the dishes of our 10 chefs. These chefs come from all corners of Roblox and are real fans of Mr. Smarty Pants. So hit subscribe and maybe you could be in the next video. Okay, enough of the talking, let's get this show rolling. Walking into the Master Chef kitchen was amazing. I couldn't believe that I was finally there. We didn't even start cooking and I was already nervous. Welcome to Roblox Master Chef. Ugh, so embarrassing. Sorry. Today is the day where the culinary world of Roblox changes forever. Today, one of you will become a master of cooking and will take home the title of Master Chef. Now, don't get too friendly with the other chefs if they're here for the exact same reason you are. If they want to win. Here is your task for today. a dish that everyone on Roblox needs to try. The second we were told our task, I instantly knew what I wanted to do. There was nothing stopping me now. I was stressing out big time. I had no idea what to cook. I mean, it sounded easy enough. What could go wrong? Make it a main meal, a snack or a dessert. It is totally up to you. You have 60 minutes and the time starts. Actually, you need to subscribe before the time starts. Have you done it? Okay, now, go go go. Um, you can start. The chefs have unlimited access to every ingredient they could possibly ask for, meaning that the possibilities of what they can cook are endless. The pantry room will be open for the whole duration of the competition. This video is sponsored by Raid Shadow Legends. Raid Shadow Legends is that game that you most definitely have heard of before, but just haven't tried yet. And that's going to change right now. Raid is completely free to play and has over 650 completely unique champions to collect from different factions. There are billions of ways to customize and build your champions, such as equipping different artifacts or leveling up your current champions by sacrificing the ones you don't want. And the game has amazing graphics with console PC quality graphics on mobile. I mean, just look at those reflections. My favorite champion so far is Galek. He's one of the rare champions that you get to choose right at the start. And he's surprisingly powerful with the skill called Hellraiser, which attacks all enemies with crazy damage. And if you haven't started playing Raid yet, use my link in the description to get Champion Tayrail, 200,000 silver, 50 gems, and ancient shards, so you can summon awesome champions as soon as you start the game. Once you're in game, come find me under the name Mr. Smiley Pants underscore, and if you're fast enough, you can join my clan. So just click the link in the description, and I'll see you in game. Also, if you're an Amazon Prime member, you can get some exclusive rewards in Raid right now. This is the best time to get started with Raid. Again, click the link in the description or scan the QR code on screen. Now, back to the video. 
The race is on. The chefs have 60 minutes to cook up a dish that will impress the judges. While the chefs are hard at work cooking up their tasty meals, the judges are curious as to what they are up to. Oh, um, what do we have here? I really want to surprise Mr. Smarty Pants with this. I'm going to recreate his signature Roblox cake, the first ever Roblox recipe he cooked on his channel. It's what started the whole cooking series for him, so I know it has a special place in his heart. To brzmi troszkę gajowo, ale dobra. She's right. My smarty pants will know if something is off about the cake. Yes, so I'm going to be following the recipe as closely as possible. First go in the eggs. I need to take four large eggs out of the carton and do- Oh goodness, what have I done? One of the chefs seems to be fairly confident with their plan. Aisha is going to use her knowledge of old Roblox to charm the judges. All these noobs here probably joined in 2023, so they'll never think of my idea. I'm thinking of recreating one of Roblox's most iconic food, the cheeseburger. You know, the one that goes, Can I have cheeseburger please? When you take it out. And then it goes, Mmm, cheeseburger. When you eat it. Yep, that one. I wonder how many people even know what she's talking about. On the other hand, Volta is going for something a bit more daring. I'll be creating something so spicy that the judges are gonna be set on fire. I'm joking of course. Right now, I'm pouring chili flakes into my tomato sauce and mixing it together. I think many of the chefs here aren't going to risk doing something spicy, because there's always that risk of it being too spicy and completely overwhelming the actual taste of the dish. But I'm willing to take that risk. I know it will turn out well. We love taking risks. Okay, this is starting to look like it has potential. I'll be creating spaghetti carbonara. I'm incorporating the world of Italy into Roblox, to really showcase just how diverse the Roblox community is. I'm cooking my pasta right now. So excuse the screaming. I cooked spaghetti bolognese once, so it'll be interesting to see how this turns out for you. Good luck. Thank you, chef. Is that a... Chicken? What in the world is this doing in our kitchen? Why is it alive? It is a chicken. We can see that. Trzeba zrobić z niej rosu. I will cook him up and serve him to you. I have a delicious meal in mind that you're just going to laugh. Can't wait for you to see it. The judges don't seem to be fully convinced, but they'll take his word. All the chefs seem to be doing pretty well, although the judges have some uncertainties. So. Who do we think is the weakest out of them all? I lack faith in Joe's ID. He's thinking about creating the red tomato sauce that he say would be perfect for eating with fries. He didn't specify what he's making but I'm praying to God that he isn't just making ketchup because I'm going to actually walk out of here. Mam was wszystkich w dupie. You are right. For me, it's the one doing English breakfast purely because there's just so much to it all. It's not just one big thing that you cook. It's multiple little things and they might not have the time for all that. The clock is ticking for the chefs, and the pressure might be getting to some of them. I'm here trying to make pizza, but my pizza dough is just not rising at all. I added all the ingredients correctly. I even added one of my own special ingredients and nothing. What am I meant to do? This is a nightmare. Oh my goodness. My recipe is going perfectly. I'm making a fruit smoothie and all the fruits are getting along. They're even perfectly okay with me cutting them up. What a surprise. I would have never guessed that Master Chef was where I would meet the most cooperating ingredients. Wow. Those fruit look really well prepared. This looks delicious. I love fruit smoothies. I can't wait to try this. To tylko owoce. Uspokój dupę. The pressure just keeps rising. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, what is going on now? 62 VC, is it serious? <laughs> Stop trying! <laughs> Przestań ryczeć. Stop trying! Oh. Huh. What? Oh. I'm just cutting onion. That's all. Sorry. I was daydreaming. One minute remaining! The chefs now need to hurry and finish up their dishes or they won't qualify. What a disaster! 
Blocky slipped and dropped their plate of food. Blocky is desperately trying to get their food back on their plate before time runs out. Because once time is up, it's up. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And time is up. It is now time for us to judge your dishes. This is the moment to have all been waiting for. This is it. The pressure was really getting to me. I just couldn't wait any longer. I was about to pass out. Jojo. You are up first. This looks very familiar. You can find the recipes for these delicious meals on the Mr. Smarty Pants YouTube channel. Today. I made for you a vanilla cake using Mr. Smarty Pants' original recipe. And you said this is based on my recipe? Yes, Chef. Right. You added sugar to this. Yes, Chef. You see, that's the problem. My original recipe did not have sugar. Wasn't the lack of sugar a mistake, though? If you check the comments on that video, there are loads of people noticing that you forgot to add sugar. That's not the point. Yes, I did forget the sugar, but you said this was a recreation of my recipe, so I was expecting no sugar. Okay, but other than the sugar, it tastes good? It's really chewy. It's called a sponge cake, but it's not supposed to taste like a sponge. You can go. I'm really frustrated at myself. I let the judges down. Rutger, please come forward. What the hell? It's not chucks! Co do jasnej ciasnej. I'm sorry. I could not bring myself to hurt it. How are we meant to judge your dish then? Unless... No! Right. You can go. I don't regret that. I'm going to take the chicken home and make it my pet. 62 VC, you are up. Today, I made for you spaghetti carbonara with sprinkles of pork and a hint of low-fat cheese. Okay, where do I start? The linguine is perfectly al dente and the sauce is well seasoned. Thank you, chef. The pasta came out great. It's wet just how I like it. I'm surprised to hear that because I added just slightly too much salt when I was cooking the pasta. Just slightly too much. You've definitely impressed us. Well done. Thank you, chef. Thank God that went well. I had a lot of self-doubt. Rocky, please come forward. Today. I have brilliantly cooked up a delicious English breakfast arrangement with Heinz beans, eggs, sausage and toast with vegan butter. Whoa, this tastes amazing. Oh my god, are you serious? No. Were you trying to make soup out of this? No chef. That just seems like the direction you were going for since it's all so soggy and wet. And there's dust everywhere. And, is that her? Yes, Chef. I might have accidentally dropped my dish into a puddle. And I didn't have time to start from the beginning. To wygląda tak samo jak moje gówno dzisiejsze. How can you even say this to us? To you, to you, to you, to you, to sight. Have some dignity. This is disgusting. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Do I need to say anything? Feel spring. Please come forward. Today, I have made for you a delicious fruit smoothie using the freshest and juiciest fruit I could find. Sorry, you said fresh fruit? It doesn't smell good. Huh? No, I was very careful with the fruit I picked. Here, try one of the apples I used. No, it's best if you try it. That's fine by me. Watch. See, I'm fine. <laughs> I'm sure he's fine. It was a poisoned apple? 
could have done this. Hi. Hi. Get them. Why did you do it? I didn't like him. You're evil. You won't get away with this. You will never take me alive. Live my world. Walter, please come forward. Today, I have made for you a spicy chili sauce that will set your taste buds on fire. Metaphorically, of course. <clears throat> I thought you said, metaphorically, and yet we just had a stroke over how spicy it was. Thank you, Chef. Jesteś nienormalna? Prawie umarłam. You can go. Oops. I must have added too many chili flakes. Even after my little speech of making food too spicy. Potis, chodź do mnie, bo dostaniesz lanie. Bloxy Color. Are you going to say anything else about your creation? I mean, it's good. It's not bad or anything. I was expecting more from you. Thank you, Chef. It kind of just seems like you took a pin of Bloxy Cola out of a fridge and tried to serve it to us. I definitely didn't do that, Chef. You can go. George, please come forward. Today, I have made for you a red tomato sauce with a hint of oregano. It goes perfectly with fries but with my dish, it's just... Just say ketchup. What? Call it what it is. Ketchup. Not exactly. My red tomato sauce recipe has been perfected throughout the... I'm not eating ketchup! I swear to you that it isn't ketchup. Please, try it. I believe you. I'll try it. Nom, nom, nom. It's literally ketchup. Get out! Gordon Ramsay was really unfair towards me. It isn't ketchup. It's more than that. And now, our final chef, Aisha. Today, I have made for you a cheeseburger with pickle, onion and lettuce. I had so much time left that I also made fries and a drink. Why is it in McDonald's packaging? For the aesthetic? This is marvelous. Thank you, Chef. The fries are done just right. The burger patty is seasoned well. It's so good that I could mistake this for a McDonald's meal. Ha ha. You're funny. You can go. It's funny that my dish was so similar to a McDonald's meal. Coincident, I guess. And just like that, all 10 chefs have presented their delicious meals to the judges. Some were good. You've definitely impressed us. Some were disappointing. I was expecting more from you. And some were just outright bad. I have some dignity! This is disgusting! And now it's time to finally end it all. It's time to pick the winner of the first ever Roblox MasterChef. Congratulations on making it through MasterChef. It wasn't easy and we know you all tried your best. Jojo, Rutger, Blocky, Pooties and George. Your dishes did not impress us enough. Jojo, your cake was chewy. Rutger, your dish was... Alive. Blocky. Pooties, you didn't put enough effort in. George, you literally just served us ketchup. It wasn't ketchup. Stop calling it that. You may all sashay away. Our finalists are 62 VC with his spaghetti carbonara, Voltaire with their chili sauce, Aisha with her cheeseburger. Congratulations, your dishes, although not perfect, 
impressed us the most. Gratuluję. Mogę już do domu. The winner of the first edition Roblox Master Chef is Aisha for her brilliantly crafted cheeseburger that made us go. Mm, Congratulations. Thank you all so much. Subscribe and like if you want to see more. All the people in this video are my actual fans that I picked out. So if you want to be in a video like this, smash subscribe. A massive thank you to my YouTube members. Thank you Rutger199, Theo Nix, Moon, your boy 32, Alito, John Verde, Epico, Pudis1960, Clownkeeper, Mandy, Shay, That Epic Developer, Fitzy, B. Washer, Cow Sands, Dark Han, Carol Seba, Rom's Content, Subface, Kami, Danny8986, Ryuki, Lionidas, Goody Gamer 41 h 2 Noah, The Channel of Victor, Caffeinated Crusader, Daniel Pronin, and Dylan Tran. Thank you all so much for watching and stay tuned for more.